Okay, so uh, the adventure, the great, great uh, Tenerife adventure begins in Dublin. Ryan are almost, almost, uh, almost uh, made Mark stay here, but he somehow managed to print his ticket. I didn't have to print my ticket, but they wanted to throw away my wrench. But after like uh, trying to convince. Uh, the security guy that it would be really difficult to disassemble the plane with that wrench. <laughs> he said, "All right." Show our smiles now. Mm -hmm. We smile. We are happy. That's before the ride. In the evening, our faces will be completely different. Okay. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. First climb down. <laughs> Some difficult moments. But it has to be like that. That's that's just life. Day, day one, the epilogue. We got alive to the hotel. Oh, alive. 100 kilometers, almost 99.7. Now we go to see the city of Santa Cruz. Oh, yeah. This is pizza with tuna. He's eating I don't know what, but it's also good. We like it here. It's yeah. nice. But it's time to leave for another day of suffering. No, just kidding. It's a pleasure. <coughs> Climbing all the hills and mountains. Worth the pedaling. It's raining just there. Before we get there it will be gone, that's good. Apparently 12 hours is not enough. to cycle 120 in the mountains we just got here it's a beautiful hostel it's just us here apparently the thing is we almost have no cash left but we have the very precious the very precious last two euro coin here please okay. please look at it it's two euro for that we can buy instant noodles which we will do Hopefully it won't get stuck. If it got stuck now, we would be super disappointed. Look, look. No! no. What? <laughs> Did you hear what I said? I said uh. like, hopefully it won't stuck. And then it did. Uh. No. Oh, sorry. Oh? We got something else. We got something <laughs> else. Okay. At least, at least we got something. At least we got something. It's not what we paid for, but this? it's still a muesli. Big congratulations to Mark, who was very persistent in this travel. More than I expected. <sighs> These guys saved us. Thank you guys, you'll be on our small <laughs> movie. You're welcome. <laughs> it's gonna be the most tasty noodles in my life. Right, so after a long wait, we are leaving our 
hostel now. It's just stopped raining. Maska. That's the name of the place. It's not exactly easy to cycle here, but come on, these views. That's the last minutes be before the sunset. We will, as usually, I think we can say now as usually, we will end our trip at night. <laughs> that from the beach to the Teide plain so to say it's the highest point here as far as I know 2.2 kilometer extremely cold next to the volcano but now I just escaped that area there's some really crazy rock formation it's a very quick descent but uh, probably I'll need to hide the camera not to crash uh, it's like 50 60 that's how fast you go here from the highest point it's uh, 35 kilometers uh, to the beach and the difference of height is uh, 2100 meters I just did this climb now which wasn't easy <laughs> but now it's just rolling down it's cold that's the only problem so, so this man just finished the the biggest climb in Europe. Is it? It is. Okay. 2,200 meters. I think it's more than 2,000. Wait, wait, 2,100, I think. 2,100. No, no, when you reach that cross crossing, then you go down and you go up again. I think it is more than 2,200. It was a lot. Yeah, I did it. I did it. Ah, now I'm look at him. Now I'm cold, so I have to take a shower. That's my... Oh, my hard work, I prepared superb breakfast. Superb, so superb. Nine more kilometers to the top of this climb. We're doing just good. Mucho fantástico. All right, we are almost at the foot of the mountain, of the volcano mountain, El Teide. I'm cycling through the clouds Through the clouds, through the clouds I am cycling through the clouds Through the clouds, through the clouds I'm cycling through the rainy cloud There's 
will be a space observatory soon. It's barely visible, but there are telescopes on the mountain. But they are there. Oh yeah, there is a picture, please. If anyone has any doubt. The telescopes. the telescopes. Now it's covered with clouds. Oh, we can see something there. Yeah, you can see that. So I'm cycling uh, back to the bike shop, bike rental shop, uh, which happens to be not too far from the airport. So I'll just uh, then drop the bike there. Mark took a shorter route because this one's gonna be like 130 something. Uh, so he, he took a shorter route, but he also has most of our luggage. And uh, we meet at the airport. Going through the cloud yet again. Some stones on the road. We're going 50! 50! I just took some sort of fog shower. Very cold one. Okay, did the bike. Finished. The trip is pretty much finished. I just need to get back to the airport. And here we are, back to Dublin. Yeah. Adventure time. It was adventure time. Just four more kilometers to finish it off. Finally. <laughs> <laughs> 